What up, what up? I'm Chad Wildclay, and I'm about to teach you how to trick people into thinking you are a piano master in five easy steps. You can do this on any piano or any keyboard. Okay, not any keyboard. Okay, step number one, thumbs up, is to use your right thumb and pick any white key you want. My favorite is this one, since it's right in front of my face and I'm lazy. Told you this was gonna be easy. And you wanna play it with lots of emotion, so like soft and hard. Congratulations, you just mastered step one. Step number two is to hold down that foot pedal to make it sound all emotional. And you're gonna be doing this because you have absolutely no skill in playing the piano at all. So instead, you're gonna be wowing people with your emotional playing. So instead of this. You're gonna be doing this. Way more epic, right? <laughs> Okay, now step number three, you're gonna have your left hand make this shape, and how you make that shape is you do the tragic head grab. And it forms that perfect shape right there. And now you take the thumb and the pinky of this shape, and then you hit any white keys you want. And just remember, there are no wrong notes, except for the ones that sound bad. Before I teach you the next step though, be sure to click on that little bell symbol down below right next to the subscribe button so you can hang out with me in the comment section below after every upload and on every live stream before every upload. Now step number four, you're gonna take your right hand and make that same shape that you were doing with your left hand. But instead of just using your thumb and pinky like your left hand, you're gonna use all your fingers and give it a little tickle. And that's gonna show the audience that you have a, a bit of a playful side. So back to playing your note. And you give it that little tickle. And hit any notes you want in any order. excited to show off to everybody how awesome you are at Piano Now, please be sure to give this video a thumbs up and let's get into the next trick. All right, step number five. You want to sell this song with a really good story. Something like this. I wrote this song after saving a young child from a lake, drowning. I dove in, pulled him to shore. His heart wasn't beating. I perform CPR and save his life. And this note represents that heartbeat. Or if there's that someone special you're trying to impress, you can try something like this. V, ever since the day I looked into your eyes, I heard music playing in my mind. This is that music. Wait, this sounds like the movie Interstellar. Now that's one of the things I need to warn you about. Using this technique, you might end up playing a song that someone else already wrote. So as a piano player, you have to be careful or you might get yourself into trouble. <laughs> okay, now there's one more thing I need to warn you about because there's this other YouTube video by Sam Time. It's a very good video on how to play piano as well. Now he recommends that you only hit the black keys. Now that technique still does work. But in this day and age, you have to be very careful because you might get something like this. Uh, why are you only hitting the black keys? That is so racist. Oh. No, 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 it's not racist. It's 
cultural appropriation, maybe. But... Now, another problem with playing only the black keys is you're going to eventually wind up playing this. Good thing I don't do this for a living because you know what they call a musician without a girlfriend. Homeless. If you guys haven't seen this video right here, go ahead and check it out. That's super duper funny. If you're not subscribed to me, click here. Although I'm sure you are because you're super talented and sweet and cool. If that doesn't look good, check this one out. It's pretty good. Okay, fine. It's amazing. All right, I'll see you guys real soon with a brand new video.